thank you for watching. Today, I am going to unbox and review this really big box. It's the perfect match gift set from the Gem and the Holograms 35th Anniversary Collection. It's really huge. It's a three doll set, Rio, Riot, and Gem. So I'm really excited. So let's get this box open. This is the shipper for the Perfect Match Rhea Pacheco Gem and Riot Llewellyn gift set, the adult collectible, the Gem and the Holograms 35th Anniversary Collection. So let's get the shipper open. Let's see. It's quite large, as you can see. Oh, it's got the beautiful tissue paper in here, folded so nicely. I appreciate that. It's a really pretty color. I'm curious to see what this box is going to look like. So maybe I will just try to dump this onto my table here. And let's see. Looks like I got it upside down. <laughs> All right, let's swing this up. Ooh. Looking kind of cool already. All right, let's remove the tissue paper. And voila, wow, that is a beautiful box. So as you can see, it's got the holographic lettering on there. It says 35th anniversary gem and the holograms, truly outrageous souvenir dolls, plural. And it says down here, adult collectibles ages 15 and up. So, Let's, this box is really heavy. Let's get it open. Let's see how this opens. Ah, actually, look on the side here. It's got more Gem and the Holograms, Truly Outrageous Souvenir Dolls. And in the back, actually, just want to take a look at it. It's got the little spotlights and stuff. That's actually cool. And the side is the same again on here. So, anyway, let's get this open. And... Voila, wow, no wonder this box is so heavy. Look at what you get here. You've got three dolls here, and you've also got this really huge accessories box here. Also, one thing I want to show you, if you look at the interior of the box here, this certainly looks like it could be used for a diorama so super cool so these are the three dolls that you get in this set obviously you get rio gem and riot let's have him face this way so what i am going to do to make this just a little bit easier is i'm going to untie each of these from the box so that we could take a closer look at each of these dolls there is a lot to unpack with the Perfect Match gift set, so I'm going to try to go over all of them as quickly as possible. So the first thing you get, of course, is your Certificate of Authenticity. It says Ultra Limited Edition. It does not say the edition size, but it is a limited edition of 600. Now, one of the other things that I wanted to show you was that you get this big giant stand where you can actually fit three dolls on the stand and of course you get all of the little rods and everything that go along with that now you also get this diorama piece here that unfolds and it actually fits a vintage star stage playset made by Hasbro <laughs> So you can either stand it up here or you can use it if you have that star stage playset by Hasbro. I don't have that, but it would be an interesting piece, I think, to have. So really cool. It looks like it's pink on the other side in case you want to use it for something else. So I did want to show you that. So the first doll that we have in this set, of course, is Rio Pacheco. And I'm actually going to remove this hairnet that he has here as it's kind of obscuring his face. 
So let's remove that. And here is a close-up of his face. This is actually the new Rio 2.0 head sculpt. So this is a brand new Rio. So there was some controversy over the face sculpt for the Rio Pacheco in the Perfect Match gift set. Now, there was a first doll called the classic Rio Pacheco that was released with a different face sculpt than this one. That was outrageous! Some collectors were disappointed and upset that he got a face change. Other collectors, like myself, actually are quite happy. I actually do like this face sculpt much better. This used to be called the Milo sculpt, but is, is now referred to as the Rio 2.0 head sculpt. So just wanted to make a note of that. His skin color is listed as Hungarian, and the hair color is called Electric Violet. So you can see him at different angles. He's got those really pretty, beautiful curls. And I just want to pull back just a bit so that you could see him fully. His body type is listed as the Ohms 1.5. As you can see, he's got this full tuxedo with the tails in the back also. Looks like some gold on the side as well. And he comes with this pair of socks. And let's see if this looks like it should open. Yeah, it looks like it opens with the little clips here. So let's see if we can get that open yeah, and we see there is a shirt that is tucked in and pants that come off there's a little belt and everything and a zipper here how very cool is that very detailed and as you can see this jacket is removable and he's got this tie here and the tie actually is removable with this little button here. So very cool. I'm glad they don't make me have to tie a tie or anything like that. Very, very cool. So Rio comes actually with a couple of things that I'd like to show you. He comes with an extra set of hands so that he can hold things. And he also comes with this pair of shoes here. So very nice, very nice quality. Next we have Gem. Now this Gem's head sculpt is the Gem head sculpt. Sometimes they use Gem, sometimes they use Jerrica. Shh, we're not supposed to know that she's the same person. No one's supposed to know. So sometimes they go back and forth between the sculpts and this is the Gem one with the smile, open smile. The skin tone is listed as Japan and the hair color is listed as bubble gum. Now let's see when we turn her to the side, she's got the rooted lashes, very nice. It looks like her ears are pre-pierced so that she can get synergy in on the job. And this is her from this angle. I'd like to pull back just a little bit so that you can see the full outfit. This outfit is actually based on the rock and curl outfit and the body for Jim is the color infusion 1.5 which means it's a little bit larger than the fashion royalty body and of course that means she has a bigger foot so she's not going to be able to wear a lot of other integrity uh, shoes and it also means that this pair of shoes that she comes with is not going to fit on your other integrity dolls which is just fine because Jem has her own style and her own everything so I'm cool with that so Jem also comes with a couple of other things she comes with a pair of hands Gem, of course, comes with a set of jewelry, which, of course, includes the Gemstar earring so that she can summon the help from Synergy. And she also comes with these pretty bracelets that will 
go with her outfit. Speaking of the outfit, it comes with this pair of pantyhose. There are no panties with it, but she doesn't need it. These are really actually more like tights, I would say, than pantyhose. It's very pretty. It matches. It's glistening. And, of course, I just wanted to see if this was a couple of pieces or one piece. And as you can see back here, it's got the little opening snaps or latches here. And it is all one piece. So this dress is a one piece. It is not two pieces, which is just great with me. Last but certainly not least is Riot, and I'm going to remove his hairnet so that we can get a better look at him. I don't want to mess up his curls. Let's see if I can. He's got a lot of hair, which is awesome. All right, so this is a close up of Riot. The head sculpt is listed as Riot, which is also known as the Ace McFly sculpt. So let's take a look at him from this side. And as you can see, his ear is pre-pierced. And let's see from this side here. Now his skin tone is listed as FR white and his hair is frost blonde, which is a really pretty color. Just wanna pull back some so that you can fully see his outfit. The body that he comes on is the Ohm's 1.5 body. And as you can see, he's got this really cool tuxedo. His, in the back, it also has the tails as well. And looks like it's got these little buttons on the back, which is actually really cool. Also, it looks like he's got these little fake cufflink things and these gloved hands, which are removable. So this is Riot. He comes with actually a couple of other things. Because he has the gloved hands, he comes with not one, but two pair of hands, as you can see here. So he has just regular hands, and then he's got, some, I guess, an alternate one where he can grab things. In addition to that, he also comes with this pair of shoes. Now, the shoes are really cool looking. They're very detailed. I am a, I love the stitching on them and the heel and everything, but honestly, I am a little bit nervous about tying and untying these shoes. I'm probably going to need some tweezers or something like that to help me and some really good lighting. So that these are the shoes here but of course he is a diva and a diva needs what jewelry so he comes with this really beautiful look at this beautiful brooch that he comes with and that goes on his sash and he also comes with this really cool earring as well as you can see so what I would like to do is I would like to get all three dolls into their accessories and then we're going to do 360 degrees on not one, not two, but all three dolls and we're going to introduce them to our panel. So this is a full length view of Perfect Match Rio Pacheco. So this is a 360 of Rio Pacheco here. Beautiful, curly, electric, violet hair. And let's take a look at the little bow tie. And of course, his glitter and gold inspired outfit. See the long tails of the suit and some of the detailing of the jacket in the back and the gold stripe on the white pants. And I'd also like to take a look at those shoes. Now, obviously I have him on another stand. He, as you remember, there is a three doll stand, but right now I'm just 
focusing on Rio. Here's a long view of the perfect match gem, and of course a 360 of gem. As you can see, the tights are really bright and colorful. I love that you can't really see through them. We've got that shimmer on them. But let's go in a little bit closer. So here's a close up of the screening of Perfect Match Gem. And you can see she's got the Gem Star earrings on. And here's some of the detail of the outfit from the back. As you can see, it's one piece and it's got the little latches on it. And of course, the bellowed skirt. And see the bows there also on the dress and of course the jewelry. I'd also like to take a look at the shoes as well. I love the contrast of the colors there. We wanted to see one last look at those really cool Gemstar earrings. Very cool. And last but certainly not least is a full length view of Perfect Match Riot. And let's do a 360. So as you can see, the suit or tuxedo from all angles got the long tails there. And of course that beautiful frost blonde hair. Let's pull him even closer to take a closer look at him. Here's a close-up of Riot, and you can see those gorgeous green eyes and beautiful hair and the earring detail that he comes with. And I'm just gonna go down, you can see the sparkly effect on his tuxedo jacket and the little buttons, and also the buttons and cufflinks that are on the jacket and shirt sleeve as well. And he also, like Rio, has the satin stripe on the side of his pants. And of course, those really cool shoes, which were, I will say, kind of difficult to tie with these big man hands. Another thing I wanted to show you was the detail of the magnetic brooch and the bow tie. And let me see if I can go in so you can see the actual magnet right there. Very cool, huh? Now that we've gotten a really good look at all three dolls, let's reunite all three together with the stand that they came with. All right, I would love to welcome our panel. First, I'd like to welcome legendary leader of the Misfits, Pizzazz. Next, we have fashion icon and queen of Mattel, Barbie. And of course, we have actress, singer, model, Alyssa Rodriguez. Now, before I speak to our panel, I'd love to get a last look at this gift set. So here are all three dolls from the Perfect Match gift set. As you can see, they are all on that stand that I was showing you earlier. So it's for three dolls. And I will just scan up so that you can see all three together. So Pizzazz, what are your thoughts on, oh, you have a note for me. Okay, let's see what this note says. Gimme Riot. <laughs> I'm sure Riot is not blushing right now. Although he is beautiful, there are two other dolls that are on this gift set. Look at their outfits, they're so nice, aren't they? Now Barbie, I know I can count on you to give me your opinion on this gift set. Oh, you have a note for me too, hmm, okay. I want Riot. Oh no, she didn't. Riot, aren't you popular tonight? I, 
But remember, panel, there are two other dolls in this gift set. Why are we all going on about Riot? Okay. Alyssa, I'm going to phrase this differently. What do you think of Jim? Oh, oh, you have a note for me too. Okay. Read my shirt. That's just rude, Alyssa. Okay, let me ask you this then, Alyssa. What do you think of the gift set? Uh, you have another note for me. Okay. I want Riot too. <laughs> okay, so obviously the panel is distracted. So maybe with the help of a little YouTube magic and the power of love, maybe I can make it happen. Let's see. Wow, looks like you get a riot, and you get a riot, and Alyssa, you get a riot, and oh, look, it was Jerrica all along, true love prevails. Well, thank you for the wonderful excitement. So in the end, true love prevails, or strong attraction. So thank you, panel. <laughs> So I must say, I am totally impressed with this gift set. I think they knocked it out of the park with all three dolls. I love Riot, I love Rio, I love the new sculpt for Rio. I love Gem, I love her outfit. I love everything about it. Just the detail of everything. Integrity Toys did a really good job. So I say if you are a fan of the Gem line, this is a good set to get your hands on. So. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please make sure that you click the like button. That's how I know that you like these videos. Also, make sure that you subscribe so that you get notified of when I come up with new videos like this one. So anyway, thanks so much for watching and I hope you have a great day.